Hello and welcome to my video. Today we are going to factorize xy minus 1 times xy plus x minus y minus 1 minus xy. This is not one of the simplest factorization problem. So if you want a little challenge and try this by yourself, please pause here and give it a try. And for the rest of you, let's get on to it. Alright, so first we have to expand this part, but let's expand cleverly. Actually, this problem is fairly easy because the hint is already obviously presented in this part. Notice that there are common parts x, y minus 1. Therefore, if we write x, y minus 1 first, then we have plus x minus y minus x, y. And seeing x, y minus 1 as the single variable, we can expand like this. So first, this times this gives x, y minus 1 square, then this times this gives x minus y, x y minus 1. And we have minus x y here. If you think this is still too complicated, you can simply substitute that common part as a. Then we can write this as a times a plus x minus y minus x y. So we have a square plus x minus y a minus x y. And this expression actually looks simpler, so let's actually use it and write on the left. Now let us take a look at this expression. Wait, isn't this the expression where we can apply this famous factorization formula? Here I used capital X because small x is already used here. So here in this problem, we have A instead of capital X, X minus Y instead of P plus Q, and minus xy instead of pq. Therefore, we can apply this formula with x being a and p being small x and q being minus y. Then, using this expression, we simply have a plus x a minus y. And if we change a back into xy minus 1, we have our final answer xy minus 1 plus x xy minus 1 minus y. And let's actually write down from higher degree to lower degree. And that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more factorization problems and many more interesting math videos. And I will see you in another video.